Hello! The YouTube is so confusing! It's so confusing! Well, YouTube live streaming is so confusing. I had to, I went live and then it was like, oh, you're not actually live. You have to click another thing to actually go live. Hi! How's it feel? I don't, I don't know about the chat. I don't know about the chat box, man. I don't like the, like, the blue, like, spanner and that. Can you turn your mic up? Oh, wait, 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 it's flipping, is the Elgato like proper loud? <gasps> is Dark Souls like proper loud? <laughs> Welcome in everyone, I'm actually a professional live streamer. I've been streaming for five years and uh, on Twitch. <gasps> Beer? Beer? I don't even have Dark Souls on. Uh, look, it's showing me my like live feed. Says I've been live for a minute and I have no feed. I can't see anything. It was double me. <laughs> uh, so I've set up like a separate profile on OBS for YouTube because it's got different settings, doesn't it? So it must have just re um, re jiggle jiggled the. Uh... Now I have no. I can't hear the. I can't hear the thingy. I can't hear the, the Switch. I'm streaming on the Switch. Nintendo Switch. I can't hear it at all, GRH. I'm going to sort it. Yeah, you guys should know anyone tuning in, especially if you're watching the VOD. Hey, there we go. I've got it now. It's my first ever YouTube live stream, which is kind of weird and exciting. Normally I stream on Twitch, I stream on Don't Rage Quit, and I play a lot of Dark Souls, but not enough lately. Not enough. Okay, right, we have audio. We have audio. Um, wait, that should be gone. <gasps> I figured it out. It was playing twice. Right, so you've got it now. Okay, we've got audio. This is my- Welcome. Welcome to my first live stream. Welcome. I'm such a noob. I could have, like, pretended. I could have been like, yeah, no, I've only been- uh, Hello, welcome, everyone. I've been creating videos for the, for YouTube since January, and this is the first time I've, I've tried to do a live stream. Uh, I don't- I actually don't know what I'm doing. I don't. I don't. But this is my character. This is what we're gonna do today. We're gonna hang out. We're just gonna see what happens. Um, and yeah, so How to Souls is meant to be an educational YouTube channel, so I've wanted my live streams to be like an open AMA, like a Q&A, and just like to talk about Dark Souls, or just to talk about whatever you wanted to talk about. We could talk about how cute Vicky is, if you want to. I'm cool with that. I think we could talk about that. Yeah. Um, but this is my Pyromancer, and this is just what I've been enjoying playing at the minute. Oh, I was gonna do a ping! Yeah, can you do like just live pings? Would that be okay? Thank you. Thank you, Vicky. UJ, Vicky is very cute. I agree. Um, so yeah, I was, the idea was like we were gonna do a playthrough where I like focused on something that I could turn into a video, like um, for example, like Solaire's Quest and just make that like a video and just have it be like, this is how you do it. Um, but I, I was a little bit nervous. <laughs> I was a little bit, I was like, oh no, what if no one turns up? I just, so I've been playing Dark Souls on the Switch uh, lately and all I, I, all I could think about was I really wanted to try like pyromancy only and I got really, really into it. So I will give you the full story of the full run so far. I've only killed two bosses, but I'll, I'll entail you the story and sort of go through my process, my, my creative slash problem solving process. Um, and then we'll get started and we'll continue on with the, with the run. Hello, Jack the Snake! Are you stream on YouTube too? This is my first ever YouTube stream. It's like my first ever, like, and I was just like, if I'm gonna do it anywhere, I'll do it on How to Souls. So I can play Dark Souls. And no one will be like, oh, look, there's Rach playing Dark Souls again. I could be like, ha, my channel is literally a Dark Souls channel. So get it up, views. Did Vicky do a... Oh, she typing. Isn't she the best? Isn't she the best? Okay. Right. But yeah, how are you, Jack? And how is everyone? I saw a noodle and an Eric as well. I hope you guys are doing well. It's um, it's weird going live at 1 p.m. It's 1 p.m. for me in the UK. Uh, Mike's just downstairs having some dinner, so that's why Evie's not with us today. But she might join us later. You know, she might. Um, so at the minute, I'm just doing this a couple times. I'm wanting to get maybe a couple more. Story time. Story of the... Pu right. <laughs> I've got an explo... Right. The character's name, okay? Don't worry about it. Her name is Absolute Weapon, right? Which, <laughs> which is like a, I guess, a Glasgow insult. Uh, oh, Sir Galloway! Oh, Flip! I didn't realise. I didn't realise. Well, now I know. Now I know the connection. 
<laughs> Hello, gamer tagged media. It's only the greatest souls playing Scott ever. Oh my god, that's like a really, that's really cool. I'd, I'd like to be known as that. Hi from Edinburgh. Mate, I'm coming to Edinburgh. We're having a big meetup in Edinburgh, October the 1st. I can't wait. I can't wait to just like kick about all the pubs and get really drunk. <laughs> Eric, doing good. I'm great. I'm, uh, I was really excited about this. Yeah, I was really excited just to, like, play some Dark Souls 1 again, really. Um, so I made this character, right? My idea was, okay, I follow a Twitch streamer. Her name is Penny Miawi, right? Penny's fab. Uh, Penny is obsessed with Dark Souls 3, and she did a thing where she played through Dark Souls 3 using every single weapon. And I was like, do you know what? I'd love to do that with Dark Souls 1, just like sort of really hone my skills, just sort of learn, maybe try out some weapons that I've never tried in the past. And I thought, right, I'm gonna make my character. Hello, Benjamin. Wait, Brenda. <laughs> Hello, Brenda. <laughs> it's so weird, everyone has different names. I don't like it. I mean, I, of course, you know what I mean. I do like it, but I don't like it. <laughs> Hi, Volka! Yep, yeah, welcome to YouTube. Look, I'm live streaming. Look, Twitch said it was okay. Twitch literally said it was okay. Um, so I wanted to copy Penny. Not copy her. We're good friends. I talked to her and I was like, hey, I would love to do this for Dark Souls 1 and just like get like hone my skills and stuff like that. So I was like, right, create my character. Absolute weapon, right? <laughs> hi Callum, hi Ewan, hello Pixel, oh my god, I'm I'm a big fan of you, thank you so much for coming along to the live stream, hi, I, you're right on time, I was just telling the, the story of this character, uh, so eventually this character is going to be, uh, she's going to do everything, okay, and I'd love to sort of take you guys on the journey of that and maybe make a couple videos on like, the best hammer, the best katana, <laughs> I don't know, um, but just like feeling really creative and just want to make loads of Dark Souls, vi Souls videos. But the one I thought was, right, I really wanted to do pyromancy only and I wanted to do it at like New Game because like doing anything at New Game Plus, I'm sorry, but it's not really that much of a challenge really, but if you're doing something from the very start, that's really hard. Um, so yeah, pyromancy only has been and I've done rolling only, guys. I've, I've not done punching only, though. I'll do that one day. But, like, Pyromancy only was the hardest start of any, like, Dark Souls challenge run I've ever done. Okay? And I'll tell you all about it once I say hi to Adicha and to Ginger. Afternoon. I tried to add you as a mod, Ginger, and it said no such Ginger exists. <laughs> I'll do it now. I mean, I don't think I need a million mods, but Ginger, Ginger is a mod on Twitch. Uh, Vessi, how does one find out how to souls? You just need to hang out and watch and be cool. You just need to be cool. <laughs> spear only? There's some good spears. I don't know. It's not quite like Demon Souls level of spears, Pixel, but like there's some, yeah, there's some decent spears. I would say more at Halberds. Halberds are maybe better. Volk, I have to head off to work, but wanted to pop up since the notification went off. Go YouTube, let's go. Hello Lee, how's it going? Hope YouTube goes well. Whis oh hi! Oh my god, Whiskey! You're not you're not Lee! Your name isn't Lee! Your name is Whiskey! What people have real names over here and it's weird. <laughs> hey Lee, my name is Rachel. <laughs> How weird is that? <laughs> thank you, thank you for coming along guys. I was I was so nervous. I was like, no one will know what I am. Because I'm on YouTube. <laughs> Uh, where did I get to there? This chat is weird. It's like, it's different, right? <clears throat> Ginge doesn't exist. It's maybe your name. I, I definitely put two R's. I don't know. I definitely put two R's. Can I like do it like this? I can't. Eh? Right, I will figure that out later, Ginge. It's fine. <laughs> Proof of his lack of soul. I should change my name to a Twitch name. Callum W. Red? Is that red? Get power within, dust crown. Red Tearstone Ring and Great Combustion. Yes, that's the plan. So I have a couple of those things. Well, I've got one of those things. Oh, I forgot to get Red Tearstone Ring. Yeah, I'm on my way to get that. Be cool, that's not an option for me. <laughs> red shirt for YouTube, it is a dress. <laughs> I had to wear red, I had to. Bad language only, Nick? Oh, I could swear here. I could swear I could say heck and titties. <laughs> Put your real name as your username. Rachel. Don't Rachel quit doesn't have the same like ring to it. Yeah. Did you do an announcement? There's a, uh, Vicky did a live ping thing. 
They should change Kappa to- Yeah, the moon face! Yeah, the Kappa's the moon face, but the moon looks proper smug and awful, so I- Yeah, I- I get it. Oh nice, Elite Pixel! I subscribe to your channel. Thank you so much! Keep following your dreams. I will! To, to, be, to be honest, like, I just- This started as, like, a project where I just wanted to talk about Dark Souls. Loads. So. Right, I've got 22,000 souls, so we are good. We're gonna head back to the Undead Bur- uh, Firelink Shrine now. We're in Undead Burger. <laughs> Okay, no worries. No worries. Hello, Steel Panda! <laughs> Who's this person? <laughs> oh, oh my god, hi! Oh, right, I, I don't know why I convinced myself that no one would come along. I was like, nobody wants, nobody wants to hang out on YouTube. But YouTube is cool! YouTube has some really cool ideas, actually, on this platform. The whole, like, having a thumbnail for a live stream. Can you get out of the way, please? Thank you. Uh, having a thumbnail for a live stream, right? is bizarre, but I quite like it. I quite like it, but I'm quite fast at making thumbnails because I've been doing it for years. But um, I can see how it might get a little bit annoying. Right, the one thing we don't want to do is die. So I think this is a good, like we only have eight fireballs, but this is a good way to use them. <laughs> it's because we do not want to die here. I do not have the Firelink Shrine bonfire, but more on that in just a sec when we get to the, when we get to Laurentius. Okay. <laughs> Is the DLC gonna be part of this? Yeah, yeah, so whenever I do a challenge run, I always do like every boss. I just, because I like doing every boss. Um, that has become a little tricky in Elden Ring. Um, I've just been doing like all remembrances in Elden Ring. But yeah, okay, so Pyromancy. When you start off as a Pyromancer, you are level one, which is great because um, you have a really nice blank slate with a good stat spread and you can, um, like it's really cheap to level up basically. Uh, whereas if you start as like a warrior or whatever starts at level 10, I think it's warrior starts at level 10. It's like, it costs you more to level up your first few points. But then uh, the distribution, uh, min-maxing. Uh, I like starting as a Pyromancer, like no matter what character I'm going to start as. Unless I'm doing a challenge run, so. I'll always recommend Pyro because it's got obviously, I just like it, it's a good start. <clears throat> well, battery, oh that's not ideal. That's, that's not ideal. But we'll, we'll sort that in a sec. So, yep, yeah, started as a Pyromancer because Pyromancy only. Uh, it was not too difficult to do the Asylum Demon. He went down with like, I think it was like all eight fireballs and, and he went down no bother. I didn't have to like, well, I didn't have to punch him to death, put it that way. More on that later. Uh, so we get out of the asset. So the main thing I was doing at the start of this game is just like a lot of the time I'm just running past things because I only have eight fireballs. I can't, like, I have to save them. They're precious. Um, so when we got to Firelink Shrine, my first like priority is like, right, we need, I needed the Dragon Bridge. And I knew, I had a feeling, I was like Toro Steaming with eight fireballs. I was like, it might be possible. I think I missed one. And I think it was like super close. Um, so we ran through, literally didn't fight anything. <laughs> ran all the way through, uh, got Toro Steaming. That was no bother at all, actually. That was fine. <clears throat> that is where the fun started after that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna catch up here. Have you changed the bitrate? I haven't. My bitrate is still just 4K because my internet is not great, Aditya. Scheduling live streams. Yeah, scheduling live streams, yeah, and being able to see them on, like, your your subscription box. I love that. I love that. It's consuming way less CPU than Twitch. They maybe just have a better player. Yeah, every boss is a little ridiculous in Elden Ring, yeah. I still don't know if I actually got every boss on my first playthrough because I was following a a user created map so who knows there might have been hidden ones <laughs> but yeah I'm playing on the switch this is um so I explained before this was a run that I just sort of started on a whim I was getting my hair done I was like in the salon so this takes about three hours getting your hair done so I was just at one point she left left me looking like something out of Monsters Inc um and I just sort of picked up my switch and started playing Dark Souls and then it just sort of went from there I like playing on the switch it's handheld it's kind of it sucks a bit but um I like the ability to just be like, right, I'm just gonna pick it up and take me, take it with me. <laughs> I love the Switch Pro Controller. Um, I'm not a huge fan, like I need to like change my brain when I play on the Switch as opposed to playing on the PlayStation or the PC. Cause I need to like, I need to rewire the A and the B button are different. <laughs> so that takes a minute, but yeah. <clears throat> 
You're precious, Brenda, you're precious. I completed Dark Souls Remastered on a Switch too. I love it, it's so good on the Switch. It runs buttery smooth, it's fab. The one thing that's not good on the Switch is the Joy-Con. I'm not a big fan of like the R button and the ZR button on the Joy-Con, no. Right, we've got the dog. Have you guys, have you guys all met my dog? Do you wanna meet you too? Hi everyone, this is the main reason why I have not been making much content lately. Evie, being annoying. Well, the main reason is moving house, but moving house and Evie. Hey, she's cute so you can forgive, right? <laughs> Fireballs are super limited, yeah, because in Dark Souls 1 you've just got spell casts rather than mana, so it's been really, really interesting. Hello, Pixie. What is this? It's a flipping YouTube live stream, isn't it? The triggered limey. Hello, lime. My day is going great so far, thank you. How are you doing? Did you just get in an open box of OLED Switch for 250... Wait, 250 pounds? Evie, piss off. I'm so tempted to get it, but I need to not waste money. Wait, do, do, but you have a Switch already, Aditya? So you could, like, sell your old Switch, right? Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> Hi Tom, welcome in. I was just telling the story of how this run is going so far. So we did Toro Seaman and I came back to, can you take her? Thank you. Um, so the next thing I needed to do, right? Because I haven't even tried gargoyles, right? On eight fireballs, I haven't even tried it. <laughs> I was like, that is not going well. I might have been able to do it, but I just, I was like, no, I'm gonna need some more arsenal here. So what I did was instead, um, I could have maybe tried Butterfly, but we needed Capra Demon, okay? And this is where the trouble came in. So I couldn't even get to Capra Demon. I am not very good at like speeding through Lower Undead Burg. I'm so bad, I get, I get caught on the dogs. I get caught on the wall. I flip it, the thieves, the thieves were like backstabbing me and like jumping on my back and back and slitting my throat. And I was just, I wanted to die. <laughs> um, so that sucked. And you will notice that the bonfire is out, right? More on that. It's coming, it's coming. Okay, so I finally made it to Capra. Well, what I, I didn't go, like, I didn't go into Capra. What I mean by that is I made it to the Capra door. I turned right, went down, opened the shortcut to Firelink Shrine. Very important. Very important. Opened the shortcut, which is up here. It's in the, like, aqueduct bit in the sewers. Brilliant, because I knew, oh, my Firelink Shrine Bonfire has 10 Estus Flasks. Bingo. I don't have to run through the dogs and the thieves. <gasps> Bingo. Fantastic. I was like, right, this is my base for Capra. And Capra can take as long as he needs to take because I have my Firelink Shrine base. So I had one go at Capra and realized that it was eight fireballs were not gonna cut it. I think I got I got both the dogs down, one fireball each, and then six fireballs got Capra to about 50% health. I then proceeded to punch him to death. One punch with a, a pyromancy flame does about four to eight damage. I think it was doing a little bit more on like a, sometimes it crits, like if he is in the middle of an attack and I hit, it does a little bit more, but but mostly it was doing four damage a hit, okay? So <laughs> we ran around for about 10 minutes. I was getting a bit bored. I was lying in bed and I was just like, I was handheld. I was like, no, nah, I'm not up for this. So I then had the idea of like, right, well, I can't get to Laurentius, who is the Pyromancy trainer. I couldn't get there because I couldn't kill Capra. I needed to kill Capra. So fun fact about Dark Souls 1 is that there's no, like, there's no spells that you really like, pick up they're all trained to you they're all sort of purchased really um the only spell that i could pick up the only pyromancy spell sorry was a spell called power within okay now power within is in everyone's favorite blight town okay which thankfully i started this character using the master key i tend to always pick the master key because it's just very, like, lots of options for someone who... Don't pick it for your first playthrough. I feel very passionate about this. Don't pick it for your first playthrough. Okay. <laughs> so, got the Master Key, went down to Blight Town, went down the lift, and then got the Blight Town uh, bonfire there. Fab. I had to then make my way backwards through the Poison Swamp 
up the uh, the wooden walkways, perilous wooden walkways filled with like fire spiders and toxic hecking thief boys. And it was, it was actually so painful. Every time I got all the way up to where Power Within was, it's sort of guarded by a big like tentacle beast. If you know, you know. It's guarded by a big tentacle beast. He one shots you. His if he hits you, he's got like well spiky legs or something. He'll one shot you. So I got there a couple times. I pressed the the X button, the triangle button, right? I pr I pressed the Elden Ring button to pick up the item and I died and I was like <sighs> I was so mad, but I finally got it. It took a long time. It took me like all night. Um, finally got power within. Fantastic. I was on my way out of Blight Town. Okay, so coming back up, like just sort of on the way back to Firelink Shrine. I then made the most, the, probably the biggest mistake that you can make uh, in a, a challenge run, and that is not knowing the game inside out. No, I am so sorry. Lock me up, throw away the game. Apparently, I don't know this game inside out. So what I did was, I thought on my way out of Blight Town, that I would pick up the Firekeeper's Soul. Okay, and it turns out, if you pick up the Firekeeper's Soul in Blight Town and the Firekeeper's Soul in the Undead Parish, uh, you know, just before Gargoyles, somehow Palpatine returns. Somehow, right? Anastasia Vastora dies, right? And I haven't even seen Loutrek he is still in his prison cell as much as I know. I haven't actually been there. Somehow she died, right? I had no idea because there would never be a situation where I just wouldn't do gargoyles, where I just wouldn't kill Lautrec because I want the fat ring. Very good ring, the fat ring. So she died, <laughs> which means uh, I actually had this very epic run. Of, I used all of my humanity. I was toxic. I was trying to run out of Blight Town. Look, I used them all. They're all gone. Um, I was running out of Blight Town and I was toxic and I was like, it's fine, I can make it. I started using humanity to heal. I can make it, got to the bonfire. Firekeeper is absent. I could have pooped. I could have pooped. <laughs> I was like, no. Um, so I looked it up and apparently, yes, if you pick up the parish and the Blight Town one. Because what I do, what I tend to do is I pick up the Parish one and I pick up the New Londo Ruins one, Limey. So like I, but I've never, I would never go down into Blight Town because who wants to do that? So we have no Firelink Shrine bonfire. That was really devastating. I don't know if I can still get the Fap Ring. I'm thinking not. I think Lautrec is just not there anymore. Um, and I'm gonna have to sacrifice that until mid playthrough. That's kind of sad. That's kind of sad. Yeah, favor and protection. Yeah, it's, it's really good at the very start of the game basically, but I <laughs> I can't get that there. I will find out though. If Lautrec is in his cell, we'll we'll set him on fire. But um, okay, so got here, I was like, balls, right? The second problem is, this was supposed to be my base for Capra Demon. <laughs> so bear in mind, from here, the last bonfire that I rested at was down in Blight Town, okay? <laughs> so I was like, right, priority one, because I didn't trust myself to do Capra first try. No chance. Priority one was to find a different bonfire. So I went to the Dragon Bridge. Uh, I'll be about two hours late. I'll be, I'll be done about three hours. See you in a bit. I went to the Dragon Bridge of the Sunlight Covenant bonfire, okay? And that was my base because all I had to do was run across the bridge, go down the, the stairs, and then obviously I still had, I had to run past all the thieves and that. Which wasn't ideal, but I didn't have my Firelink bonfire, so I had to do that. So, um, I figured, I was like, right, well, I'm just gonna try it. Eventually got to Capra, launched myself into that door. Got him first try, but it was the most, the most horrible Capra demon fight I've ever done. And like I said, I have done rolling only. Rolling only was easier than this. So... Power Within is fab. It makes you do 40% more damage. Uh, and I think it gives you more stamina regen as well, something like that, um, which was good. That was good. Um, but I missed a fireball, okay? I missed a fireball uh, and we got him to, he was like 30%, 20% HP. That was a lot of punching, guys. <laughs> Punches do four damage a hit. That was a lot of punching. But I finally got him and then immediately died because the, the dogs came running in and killed me, but I got what I wanted and that was the key to the depths from Capra, so. 
Oh, it was so funny. I really wish I'd streamed it, but like I said, I didn't realize this was gonna be such a good run. But hey, hopefully my storytelling does it justice. <laughs> Um, I've never tried this run, so I've never had this problem. I've been stressing myself out trying to do no death. Yeah, I tried no death any percent and I still never got the zero. I got I got one, I died to one of the dogs in the Tomb of the Giants and I just never really had the heart to try again. It's really soul destroying like when you die. Uh, what about Undead Parish? Yeah, Undead Parish would have worked, yeah, and just like ran up from Andre and then took the short cut down and then went up and then they were as broad as they were long really like it, they would have taken the same amount of time could you do a challenge run with the least number of bonfires absolutely i could do a challenge run where i touch not a single bonfire uh so it would be obviously rl1 or whatever sl1 uh, i could do that that would not actually be that difficult <laughs> because i would be able to use whatever i wanted to use right does it sounds fun house yeah yeah undead parish yeah I've done no death any percent a few times. I'm not very consistent though. Nice! See, I, I, just, I just stopped doing it. I was like, I was streaming it and it was very high pressure and I like to be very interactive and I just, I just sort of gave up. You're 11, what the flip? And you've beaten Dark Souls and DLC. God, you're like better at games than me, Pixel, honestly. Much better. <laughs> But no, we finally got Capra, went into the depths, got Laurentius, he's over here. So what I did then was I went back to the Dragon Bridge and I just was chilling. I was cooking some dinner, some like chicken or whatever, and I was just doing the Dragon Bridge again and again. So here's the boy. Oh, hello there. Oh, um, we got to protect him at all costs, right? So we can uh, level up our Pyromancy Glove. Took the liberty of getting it to plus three. This is the only way you can uh, make your pyromancies do more damage is by leveling up your pyromancy glove. Um, and the best thing ever from this guy, another copy of Fireball. Hail ye. Well, now I feel inadequate. I know Ginge, Ginge, one day Ginge will complete Dark Souls. He will, he will, don't worry. <laughs> I've been watching people do God Run 3. I can't imagine being able to no hit. Yeah, I started trying to learn no hit for Dark Souls 1, but I just, it's like, you have to proper no life it, you know? <laughs> Hello, Adrenus! Welcome in! You made it! You made it! Welcome! We are, um, I just got done retelling the tales of, uh, the absolute weapons, uh, journey. So, bought a couple things. I need to, what's my, uh, attunement? <gasps> I have no bonfire! I hate, I hate this so much. I miss her so much. Let's plug in the controller. this gonna be a pain standing plugged in oh no I mean this is fine <laughs> this is fine hi Dave at work so can't stick around but I had to pop in to say hi thank you eee, I hope your day at work is good Div. Uh, yeah Tencent bought 30% from soft yeah they already Sony already I think Tencent as well already owned some of from soft so it's not a huge like a huge big deal but yeah i'd quite like right so it's 19 i think attunement to get another slot so i think we'll stick with the four i'm gonna get second fireball and i'm gonna get combustion i think although oh, hang on fire orb hmm Goodbye, then. Beast, don't you? do i want to use so i've got thirteen thousand souls at the minute do i want to use these souls to try and get 19 attunement or do I want to use them to upgrade? I think I'm going to upgrade my glove. Yeah, I think that's probably the best way to do it. Because I'm going to get souls from beaten bosses. So there we go. We got it to plus six. That's really good. And we've not done gargoyles yet. In fact, I think that's what we're going to do now. Yeah, let's do that now. <clears throat> Hi, Aaron. Hi, Hannah. Good afternoon. Welcome to How to Souls. <laughs> Do I have a Discord server? I do. It's in the comments of the video, right? Or in the description, right? It should be. Streaming on the red site. It, it's so weird, Adam. It's so weird. <laughs> I miss Twitch. I miss emotes. Where's all my emotes? Uh, to be fair, guys, I actually think we're maybe going to hit partnership today so we can get Twitch emotes. Uh, <laughs> YouTube emotes. Dark Souls mobile? Oh, flip. I'd play that. I'd play the heck out of that. Right, we gotta go straight through here. Wait, he's still chilling there. You've been there since I ran through here, sir. What the flip? <gasps> it's not in the, oh, it's not, oh. um, I, I, 
maybe someone can post it for me. <laughs> I oh, it's in my it's in my Don't Rage Quit channel. That's what it is. I'm bananas, gamer. Excuse me. I'm not bananas. I'm aubergines. I don't know. Um, thank you. That's heckin' that's cute. I'm glad I can inspire you because I just I like I don't know, it's fun. <laughs> it's fun. Okay, so I want my first spell to be Fireball. Yeah, so we'll get another fireball. And then I think Fire Orb only has six slots, but Combustion has 16. Am I gonna be up close with gargoyles? Yeah, okay. Combustion I think is the right move. And then having more fireballs is better than having one fire orb i think especially because i seem to be uh not great at uh not great at throwing <laughs> did you say you were 11 yeah wait hang on oh no that's right oh discord discord age limit is 13 yeah so that's we can't yeah sorry i didn't even think of that <laughs> sparta i'll be lurking as the chat doesn't work on desktop what the flip why oh 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 why not that's so weird Oh yeah, sorry, Pixel. Yeah, sorry, I totally forgot about that. Nice one, GRH, good modding. Good modding. Yeah. I punched him. Oh, I didn't realize he would follow. Uh, let's run, let's just run. Let's see what happens. <laughs> we did it. <laughs> I forgot to go check for Lower Trek, but let's just do Gargoyles. It's probably from the browser I use with Vivaldi. Vivaldi. Uh, right, so before we go in, no, 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 we can go in. We can go in with Gargoyles. It doesn't start until we go to the roof. So we can go in and we can just sort of prepare. So we're gonna buff up. We're gonna use Power Within. I'm gonna immediately switch to, yeah, let's do Fireball because he's gonna take a while to get to us. So yeah, Power Within makes us do 40% more damage. But it does tick our health. It's something like 1%. It's like 1% a second or something. Need to be off again. No worries, Div. Take care. May the souls be in your favor. Oh. Oh. oh, this feels so weird. I haven't played Dark Souls in so long. It's been all Elden Ring, man. I'm going to switch to Combustion. Let's do that. Yeah, this is pretty OP. This is pretty powerful. Right, so you're blowing fire at me. What if I blow fire at you? The flip of the effect, I can't tell what part of the fire is gonna hurt me because of the, <laughs> because of how bad the fire looks. I can't tell. Where do I roll? Oh, and also there's only four planes of roll movement. That's so weird. This game is so old! <laughs> I love it. We love to see it. Oh my god! Yay, gargoyles! Oh, we've got plenty power now. I have a funny feeling that the start of this run is just the only hard bit. I don't think it's going to be too bad from here on out. Unless, is there anything that has so much health that I probably cannot carry enough fireballs for it? Probably not. Yeah. <gasps> First try! Woo woo! <laughs> Combustion is amazing. I think if you can get something that is like stunned by it like that, that was great. Quailag is immune to fire. Yeah, so I think I might um, have to just get Thingy for that. Uh, Mildred for that. I think that's probably going to be the one boss that I will have to summon for. Yeah. It's okay. It's no, it's like, as long as I don't go online, I'm personally fine. As long as I don't use online features, I, I, that's what I do. You could get poison mist. Uh, no, you can't because Engi sells that, doesn't he? Punch the spider. Oh, pfft. wait, was, does the punch do physical damage or fire damage? I'm not punching her to death. I'm sorry. I would get Mildred. <laughs> I would get Mildred before I would punch a quail lag to death, and I'll tell you why. Do you want to know why? My challenge run. <laughs> my rules. Oh my god, I have power over Ginge here. Ooh, only because for some reason it won't let me mod him. 
Uh, I don't really think we need to, do we need do we need do we need loads of mods? I don't know. <clears throat> uh right. Don't know what he sells. Well I do know what he sells, but there. Uh, but there. Uh, uh I thought Poison Mist was sell sold by Engi and you can only get that after Quaylag. I'll have to double check. Also, I don't even know if she can be poisoned. It's entirely possible that she can, eh? <laughs> Vicky is mad with power. <laughs> She's loving it. Let oh, let's see if we can get like all three of these guys with one combustion. That would be swell. They'll just take their time coming up. The quickest way would be, I could use a homeward bone actually. Do I have any? I should buy some. Oh, I've got seven, that's fine. We'll just use one. That's fine. Yeah, it's off Engie, so we can't use it for quite like them. <laughs> Vicky be like. <laughs> uh, oh, great combustion will be good. I'm just gonna put my little fan on. Sorry if it's a bit loud. Just gonna put my little fan on. Here we go. Okay, so back in the parish, we're gonna go for butterfly next. Uh, I would like, um, I would like Murichinmin seems like the thing that's gonna help the most. Can I get to Yeah, 19, nice. Uh Vitality, obviously, endurance. Obviously. That's really interesting. So we're gonna we're gonna mostly want souls for leveling up my glove. But I can only level up my glove at Firelink Shrine. Mm. Right, I'm gonna hang on to these souls now. <laughs> Which makes me nervous. Just don't lose them. 69. Nice. Uh, hi, Sean. You can get poison mist in the Blight Town Swamp with the tattered cloth set. <gasps> That's an idea. Actually, yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. I just knew that Engie sold it. Well, we tried to uh, Titanite Demon. We'll try Titanite Demon. I usually, I don't do this guy without a shield because he's got really weird like hitboxes. Yeah, yeah, oh! I really wish I could dodge diagonally. Are you gonna do another lightning? Oh, can you hit further than me? No! <laughs> My health! Oh, that should have hit! <laughs> all this time, all this time and Titanite Demon scares me, man. Uh, let's go rest. <clears throat> I'm avoiding adult responsibility. Same. <laughs> Wait, no, this is my job. This is my job. <laughs> Team Vicky seems to be winning. Wait, is it a competition? Is it like a uh, Splatfest? There's poison mist in the swamp. Okay, well, I don't mind. Do, I, I, like I said, I just admitted at the start of this stream, I don't know everything. Like I Google, like everyone else. I know how to use Google. Didn't the remaster add eight way rolling? I don't know, I can't roll flipping. I'm just, I've been playing so much Elden Ring. I just got finished up doing Elden Ring level one. So when I do like that, I expect it to go like, it's exactly where my stick is pointing, not like away over there. <laughs> There's no competition between Vicky and Ginge. Oh! <laughs> it's Vicky. Please, it's Vicky. I think I'm just gonna use a shield because I'm a heckin' mess at this. Oh, I've got one. I literally have a shield. I'm gonna die to a flippin' int, man. You guys not weak to fire? You guys not weak to fire? Um, but yeah, sorry, just a little disclaimer because I didn't realize I would have to do a disclaimer. Like, I just am a hobbyist. I like, I play loads of other games. I'm not like an expert, but I just really, really like Dark Souls, especially Dark Souls 1. Um, but it's, oh god, is it so weird going back to it. Like, good weird, though. Would it have killed you to give me a purple one? Would it have killed you? 
Yes, it would have killed you. <laughs> Get it. I'm playing Dark Souls on the Switch right now. I'm gonna upgrade my Pyromancy, but the trolls near Quelag's Arena killed Quilana. Oh, did they? Well, guess you're hexed. I mean, you can still use Laurentius, right? Oh, Fireball does more than Combustion. That's good, but Combustion has that sort of like quickness to it. Very, very scary when used up close. Great Combustion would be great. I can't actually remember where you get that. It's been a long time since I've had a Pyromancer. The last run I did on Dark Souls 1 was we did a Floppy Souls playthrough and I was using the Great Scythe. <laughs> yeah, Dark Souls is on the Switch, Hannah. Yeah, I'm playing it on the Switch right now. That's why all the button prompts come up looking weird. And why sometimes I will backstep off of ledges. <laughs> Sat watching this all unfold while in a meeting. Thanks, team! <laughs> One of those meetings where you just have to be there. You just have to be like on camera, but you don't have to say anything. Best kind of meeting. Uh, oh, I've got five humanity. Uh, let's just, may as well just go ahead and pop that in here. Uh, Cause we'll use this for, we could use this for Sif if I'm feeling particularly lazy. Oh, we'll just, we'll just pop it in here anyway. The idea is I want to have every single bonfire kindled to like level four. Because this is a run I'm going to take plus, plus two, plus three, plus four, whatever. And we're going to use a different weapon every single time. Um, and I'm just going to chip away at it just for fun. Never done a proper Pyro playthrough. I start it as a thin to, and then I bounce to a big bonk stick and a shield. See, I love using a shield. I just, I think while well, I'm getting back used to this game, you just like what you like, you know? Yeah, Pyro is really, really powerful. If you've ever tried soul level one, I think that's when you realise like how <laughs> ridiculously easy Pyromancy is. But then if you've got a wee like sword to go alongside it, it's great. Yeah. Please don't tell me what to do, Elite Pixel. I know I know what to do and I know that I'm not getting heavy armor because I don't like heavy armor. I wanna play it so bad. But I'm gonna stick with Elden Ring. Hannah, what the flip? You play what you wanna play. You play what you wanna play. It's okay, Pixel, no bother. I just I know this game pretty well, so. <laughs> okay, I got the poison mist thing wrong, but like, it's fine. <clears throat> it's been so nice seeing you in your element again, but I can see stuff unfolding downstairs that's gonna need me. That's fair, Ging, that's fair. <laughs> I'll see you later, pal. Have a good afternoon. Right, okay, I think we can do this on uh, 16 fireballs. We just have to use combustion when he lands. He, she, they, when they land. Okay, so fun fact, you can't actually damage it right away. That's fun. And also I'm so bad at dodging those. Like. Are we gonna get you before you land, Paul? Quick lasers! Yeah, you're landing. Okay, I don't know why I was ever worried about that. <laughs> Later, Ginger Tater. Ugh, if your tater is orange, you should get it checked out. Yeah, you should get that looked at. Yeah. <clears throat> Woo! Bobby! <laughs> Wait, but people that don't know the Bobby story are just gonna think that we're just shouting. Penis for no reason. Well, Scottish people are gonna think that. Other people are like, who's Bobby? Who's Bobby? Lemmy's cat, Lemmy's cat is Bobby. Right, basement key, divine ember. Divine ember might be good for, not this playthrough. <laughs> Explain the Bob saga. Right, Bobby was my Adel one character in Elden Ring. And he was Bobby the barman and he was very good. Uh, let's just use this, I'm so lazy. Let's just use this. The big booba lady in Anna Londo is illusory. Yes, I like I said, I know quite a lot about this game. Yeah, you can you can kill her. You shouldn't, but you can. And then you get to fight Gwendolyn. We like a nice bob around here. I mean, are do you get nice bobs? Do they exist? They're all a bit weird looking. 
But yeah, Bobby, Bobby was very good. And also, RL1 was very hard. Very hard. It took me about 90 hours. 9-0 to do it. So we celebrate Bobby's every success because it was so difficult. Imagine Bobby's area being hard. <clears throat> Hello, Brad. Oh, you came at a very good time. <laughs> um, but yes, her name is Guinevere Pixel. Ah! Ah, your range. Where can I get me some range like that? Heck. <laughs> Would it be too much to get a heckin' blooming clump? No. Uh, we can go down there and do Hydra and then Hydra drops, uh, what is Hydra drop? I'm sure Hydra drops something very good. We can get the Dust Crown Ring if we do Hydra. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, but I did want to, oh. Back to Laurentius. And then, wait, can we can go like through the Valley of the Drakes? Let's have a think. So down there is done then, or we can go down and that's down there. And then we go. Oh, but I need to, no. I'll go this way, it's safer. <laughs> Man, my head is just so not in Dark Souls 1 right now. By Havel, yeah, no, I can't be bothered. I'm going this way. It's much safer. Yeah, people, do oh, I'm back in my day. Kids these days. Kids these days don't know how easy they've got it. Back in my day, we had to run from bonfire to bonfire, and if we accidentally got the bonfire keeper killed, <laughs> then we didn't even have a bonfire. <laughs> you Elden Ring children with your Elden Ring and your Eldens and your rings. <clears throat> Are you planning a full Dark Souls series as Pyro only now? Wink. Would you like me to make this into a video? <laughs> I don't, I, I could, um, if this is something you guys like watching on stream, I can save this for stream, for sure. Thursdays are going to be my YouTube day, um, whether that's live streaming or, I've done sorcery only, it was really good. Watched your one-handed video, it's so good. Oh, one-handed was not that bad, actually. <laughs> Ornstein and Smo was really hard, but then once I did that, it was fine. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, like I said, if you guys are enjoying, then. Hello, Sean. I fire like bonfire keeper is dead for the whole game now. Oh God, no. Thankfully, thankfully, it's only until you get to Anna Londo. So when you get to Anna Londo, you can use the, when you loot her corpse, you'll get this black eye orb, oh, the, the, the switch controller. Black eye orb, right? So that quivers, your orb quivers. When you get to the main sort of like room in Anor Londo, like before Arnstein and Smo. So if you use it there, you will invade Lautrec, which is fun. Uh, and you can kill him and then you get her soul back and then you take her soul back to her body and she comes back to life. And she can speak! She learns how to speak! Which is crazy! Oh, is this getting really expensive now? Okay, so we got two more levels. It's gonna cost me 10,000 souls to get another level. So this is sort of like our cap for a wee while because we're not gonna be back here for a wee while. Um, but yeah, I'm just gonna see if Lautrec is down here. I don't think he will be. He isn't, no, because he's already killed her. That is really suboptimal. This is, that's, that's not very cash money. That's not very min-max of me. <laughs> That's how we learn. I do think that a lot of people were stressing so much about their first Elden Ring playthrough, but like they, they do forget the main way that you learn, especially with like NPC stuff in this game, is by making mistakes. <laughs> That's how you learn. Like I learned not to tell Bok where he can become pretty, for example. <laughs> On my first playthrough, ONS was really easy because I used the dragon tooth. I don't believe you. Did you use a summon? I don't believe you, <laughs> but that's okay. Nikki told me about this really good AI program that makes images. Oh yeah, I saw Realistic Soda, Brad, yeah, not a fan. Uh, let's get this guy because easy titty shard. Don't you block me. Hey girl, do I make your black orb quiver? We could have Dark Souls pick up lines. <laughs> You should just learn by watching an amazing channel. Oh, you got Solaire. Okay, right, okay. To, 
To be fair, even doing it with Solaire is still kind of hard. Wait, yeah, Hydra, Hydra, Hydra. Damn. Cyberpunk Loki. Wait, is this in Discord? Cyberpunk Loki. That sounds fun. <gasps> I got a message from just Callan. Is a baby. Oh my god, when someone's sorry, this is betraying her trust a little bit, but when someone messages you just to say that they are thinking about you. Oh my god, she's so cool. I love her so much. She's so cool, man. Oh no, you haven't posted right, I want you to post Loki, Brad. I've got Discord open. It's Hydra time! Let's go! <laughs> oh! Oh! I see, the, I see what they've done. I see what they've done with the horns and then with the coat. The, number one is actually my favorite one. Yeah, that's cool. Wait, so is this like the uh, the thing that we were playing around with? The, uh, the like, yeah, the bot? Very smart bot. Making, uh, making like um, predictions based on like Google searches and that, yeah. When you first tried Margot and went back for the jellyfish and then got him instantly. On my first playthrough, Hannah? I was gonna say, I didn't first try Oh, when I first tried. At first when I tried, not when I killed him first try. Got you, yeah, yeah, yeah. Jellyfish made it so much easier. Yeah. <laughs> I would love I would love this channel to just be full of like really interesting little videos like that like uh, did you know how easy Margaret is if you just get the jellyfish ash and then it's like uh oh you've done too much and you've missed out on the ash that's okay don't fear all you have to do is go to the round table and blah 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 like I was helping Matt with that the other day but like I should make a video on that wow okay one combustion <gasps> So I'm saving up on like Twinkling Titanite and stuff like that just for future playthroughs but usually on a challenge run I don't bother picking up a lot of stuff. I just kind of run past everything. Um, but yeah, like crystal lizards I definitely want to get because we've got a lot of weapons to level up. <sighs> it's okay Hannah, no it was me. Like when I say first try, like sorry when I see first try I think first try. Speaking of first try, if we can get Black Knight Halberd here, I'll happily do New Game Plus with the Black Halberds. <laughs> That'll be a challenge, yeah. Only using Black Halberd, I promise. It's a challenge run. It's not a challenge. It's not a challenge, it's really easy. I'm kind of excited that any shield can parry though. Like, I could parry if I wanted to, if I could remember how to parry. Maybe I should be getting the bonfire. <gasps> oh! I thought I was more curved round the. Oh! <laughs> the first weapon I fell in love with was Dragon Tooth because it carried my back on ONS. I think it's too heavy for me. Like in my opinion, I prefer to be a bit more zippy. It's way too heavy for me. Did you have like fifty endurance or something? Not to my fave. <clears throat> okay, I'm making that bigger. Okay, right. Oh, I lost my humanity as well. That's sad. That's a shame. Is that the first day? Is that the first- 60? No, you wouldn't get 60. I was joking when I said 50. 30 would probably do it. Maybe. Or 40. On the game plus plus. Nice. Enjoying how much uh, harder everything hits, I'm sure. I've never really, I've never had a single character go further than New Game Plus Plus for the Platinum on PlayStation. Like I've never, I've never just bothered to go past that because I like starting again. Like my favorite thing is starting from scratch and then seeing like how I can limit myself in some way. Like Pyro only, I can't stress how hard it was trying to do Capra and then like, <laughs> and then losing the Firelink Shrine bonfire, that was just, ah, it was so, oh. Man, Artori. I love Artorius. He's my boyfriend. He is my boyfriend. I will wear his clothes like a girlfriend would wear their boyfriend's uh, hoodie. I will wear his clothes. But you can't upgrade it, no? 
That's a good point, actually. You can upgrade armor in this. I forgot about that. I'm just gonna run past him and get the... Wait, did you just... No. I thought he was so close to, like, charging off the edge there. We got to New Game Plus 20 with the flip on one of the fundraiser streams where we could spend points to roll credits. Oh, Branda, please! <laughs> Technically, te we, te well, I didn't do it. You did it. You did the one because it was that was for charity. That was you. That wasn't me. <laughs> okay, right. Your bull bag. Your bull bag. Where is he? I think he's went up. He went up to try and get me. Yeah, most armor you can, but armor that you get like from a boss, boss soul, boss defeat, you can't a lot of the time. I leave for five minutes and you haven't beat the game blindfolded with one hand and pyromancy only. Are you even a gamer? No, I'm not a gamer. I'm a woman. I've got boobies, so... We're not actually gamers. So you can sort of abuse his AI here if you're a little bit nervous about fighting him. Um, He doesn't ever go further than this point, so you can kind of... Oh, you can kind of sort of abuse this and just get him while he's backing off, especially if you're like a caster or something because you can't really hit when he's got his shield up so you can sort of like get him just as he's backing off up oh, that's not gonna hit yeah it's pretty good obviously the easiest way to kill him is just by like oh my god we got it we got it that has like a 10 percent chance or something Oh, the easiest way is to parry him and then go around the back and backstab him so you kick him off the edge. Um, or even just to like try and maneuver him so that you can backstab him as he's facing off the edge. Like that's the easiest way to get him. But um, that is another way if you're like, if you've got some range. Or if you're just a little bit nervous, you can always like kick back to the bonfire. <clears throat> <clears throat> and yeah, if you do get a Black Knight Halberd, if you get any Black Knight weapon, except for maybe the Ultra Great Swords or the like um, Great Axe, they're kind of like big and slow, but I, I mean, if big and slow is your kind of thing, then I would definitely recommend if you do get a Black Knight Halberd or a Black Knight Sword, you should upgrade it. It uses Twinkling Titanite. It's super easy to upgrade. Kind of expensive, but you get loads if you just kill the Crystal Lizards. If you ever miss a crystal lizard, just reload the game like that and then load back in and it'll be alive again. So, hi Kyle, no Twitch. No, 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 I'm still streaming on Twitch, don't worry. I just, um, Twitch said it was cool to stream on YouTube as well. So I like, I thought I would do a little, uh, thought I would try a little YouTube stream. Yeah. I might just, um, see if Hydra can kill these guys. See if we can like tease Hydra into killing them. He doesn't seem to want to spit. You more of a swallow person? Hey, that's okay. I don't understand, but like, that's okay. I can't get you to spit at me. Maybe you have to go a little closer. I don't really want to waste my fireballs. Hmm. Yeah, I'm playing on the Switch. Yeah, Dark Souls Remastered, yeah. Here we go, okay. Okay, so. That hit me, I was rolling. Here it comes, it's gonna get ya. <laughs> this is a good method, obviously, if you're doing some kind of challenge where you've got limited resources, like Pyromancer. Uh, the Hydra will kill them pretty easily. It's quite easy for yourself to get obviously caught in the crossfire, but you can just try and uh, just be vigilant. Uh, nah, we're too far away now. Okay. <clears throat> I'm used to pressing A when Dark Souls needs B. Oh yeah, because it's um, it's got like PlayStation button layout, yeah. Right, Kyle, are fire bombs allowed? I'd prefer not to, but I might use them for a bit of chaos. 
I know, I prefer not to. Technically, Firebomb is fire, yeah, but like, I prefer to only use Pyromancer. Yeah. Firebomb only would be cool. Uh, consumables only is something I've always wanted to do. Okay, so we're here, but we need, um, yeah, I need those golems to die. So I'm just gonna camp here. Camp here. They're not hitting them. Okay, there we go, they're going down. I might need to heal here. Hey, there we go, okay, let's do a little heal. So we're gonna use combustion for this, no need for a power within. Oh, if I could get two heads at once, that'd be ideal. Whoa, it took me with it! That almost put me right in the, in the drink! Ah. Oh. And my fireballs won't like stretch far enough for me to do, to like just go for the body. If you're doing boat only, you're laughing. Yeah, this is Hydra, the second one is in, do you mean the one in Ash Lake? Let's try and go for the left ones. That's okay, Jack. Oh, hey, you should ha you should definitely play Dark Souls 1. Hey, I blocked. Did I not block? I must have let go. Dark Souls 1 is so special. Hi, Miss Murder. Done by only sounds great. Let's do that sometime. That sounds awesome. That sounds really fun. Could we, um, because it'll be super painful. Could we, like, um, could we, like, cheat? Could I, like, uh, dupe? Could I dupe the Dung Pies? Because see, like farming for them from the ogres, uh, from the from the omens, whatever you want to call them, I'm not up for it. <sighs> Am I missing there? I guess I was missing. Call it the monkey run. Oh my god! I could call my character like a monkey, just throw poo at people. Oh my god! Did that hit? I don't think that hit. Oh no, it did hit, it did hit. <gasps> hey, Miss Murder, can I? Yeah, I can jip, I can jip on uh, PC, no problem. I've actually got a video on that if anyone's curious. You can jip uh, consumables, so that includes souls and humanity as well, you can jip them. I missed! Ah, Mr. Posh Shark, hello! Mr. Posh Shark. Bring me a dream, bum 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 bum. Make it the cutest shark that I've ever seen, bum 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 bum. I'm not really that good at free casting. Is that him? Is he dead? No, one more head, one more head. One more head. Hi, Mark! Well, this is an unexpected surprise. Hey! Oh, we did it! Dust Crown Ring, that's what I wanted. Dusk crown ring. So what this does is this is the increased uses, right? Yes, extra magic castings, but half HP. Half HP. Ooh, but uh, if it gives me two power withins, mm, oh no! But with half HP. Ooh, I don't know. Ooh, it's kind of a, ooh, it's a situational one. We might need that on like bosses that have loads of HP. Like we might need it for Manus because I can do Manus hitless like pretty much, so. Yeah, hmm. Yeah, that's maybe the kind of thing. Yeah, I would use it for bosses maybe. Get the Dust Crown Ring. Uh, no. No. <laughs> I'll get, I'll get it. You can calm down. You don't have to type in capitals, right? Wait, how can I bring you a dream when you're already so dreamy? Boshy! Bring me a white chocolate bar. A dream. <laughs> I've got to steal that, right? <laughs> oh, you don't need to remove all the HP. You just remove all the heads. Yeah, that's what I did, yeah. That's what I did. 
I love that. I'm sorry. In the nicest way, I love that you're trying to tell me things about Dark Souls. I love that. But do you know what, though? I do, right, without being a dick about it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for being a dick. Um, there are still things to learn. Like, there's, it's actually impossible to know everything because there's so much to learn. Right, okay, so we've done Hydra, got Dusk Crown Ring. We rest here, we can get, um, yeah, we can get Dusk. We can get Dusk if we rest here and then start the DLC quest line. Would the Mage Ring work for Pyro or is it just for Medicals? Hmm. Mage Ring, Sorcery Ring? No, I want white chocolate. I had a white chocolate, um, sorry, white, white hot chocolate. So hot chocolate, but it was white chocolate the other day. It was so good. Oh, so good. I can't have them too often though. Like we've got, um, so we've got like in the cupboard, we've got mil normal like hot chocolate, milk chocolate. And then we have the white hot chocolate and we buy twice as much of the milk, like normal hot chocolate. <laughs> as we do of the white one because I just don't have the white one very often it's too it's very sweet yeah I'm from the UK I'm from Scotland pixel brother and sister-in-law dropped off a belated birthday prezi last night got a whack of dragon ball dragon ball chocolate bars huh da Vinci? it's the one you can find closer to where Sif is uh god item placements my brain is very much elden ring i know there's a ring that's like it's like orange in color that could be dark souls 2 though could be dark souls 2 though and it gives you extra attunement slots is that the one you're on about extra attunement slots but you like you take more damage or something Kyle, I actually have rung one bell. I haven't done Quaylag yet. Quaylag is going to be... I'm not really sure how I want to do Quaylag. I think we could try and poison her to death. Um, I would rather not use a summon. So yeah, the poison the poison could work. Alright, and normally I'd try and get up close to him, but I don't have the ring. Yeah, the UK is all right. It's kind of... Uh. <laughs> I'm moving back to Scotland next month. I'm really excited. I live in England at the minute. Okay, done. Right, so you need to have killed Hydra and either... No, I, I don't think it works if you quit out. I think you have to physically rest at a bonfire. Come back here, kill the gold golem, and this is how you start the DLC quest line. Uh, so, chat into this lovely lass. <laughs> Most gracious, I am deeply obliged. I've only seen it once. It's increased, oh, decreased casting time, the sage my ring. Hope, hope, ah, it's blue. Yeah, it's blue. I know the one. Yes, you're fine. You're fine, Dusk. You're fine. Yeah, that could work. Um, the cool thing is, if I get enough, like, health and stamina, and I'm sort of happy, and then if we level up the... If we level up our pyromancy glove to plus 15 or whatever it is, I know you can ascend it. I need to like, I need to, oh God, I need to refresh my memory on that. Um, if we get to the point where we have loads and loads of souls and we don't know what to do with them, did you know we could just level dex? Because dex, right, has the same effect as the sage ring, uh, where it lowers casting, which is cool, right? So I think if you get like 25, it's, it's every point, from 25 to about 40, I could be wrong. Um, I think 40 is where it stops, where it caps. Um, your dexterity will decrease your cast time. So it's actually really good if you're planning on doing like a hybrid build to go dex int or dex faith because of that. I mean, it's, it's again, it's just if you're min-maxing. I don't know, we can do Sif. I'm a little bit less confident about Sif um, just because she jumps around so much. But um, I do have 16 fireballs and combustion and power within. Mm. Oh, and I have another achievement slot that I never filled. We could do Sif, actually. Sif might go okay. 
Yeah. Okay, we'll give that a go. Very cool and no added weight. Hey. <laughs> Tell us about Scotland, Jack. Oh, so, uh, Scotland is... Um, people are... You'll find about the Scots is... Scots are very proud to be Scots. <laughs> Scotland doesn't really like being on top of England, but here we are. We're just on top, aren't we? Oh, balls. <laughs> Bums. We're just on top. Uh, Scotland's great. We're known for our deep fried fast foods, uh, our love of drinking alcohol, uh, our loudness in the street. But we're actually super heckin' friendly, um, apart from all the stabbings in the capital. Um, not so much in the capital, actually. More in the West. <laughs> uh, we're known for our teen pregnancies, uh, our drug problems. <laughs> <laughs> And our, uh, our road accidents on the A9. <laughs> We've got monsters in uh, large pools of water that are aptly named lochs. Um, we've got big high mountains. At least you're honest. <laughs> our traditions include binge drinking and casual violence. <laughs> Oh, gotta be careful in Scotland because wild haggis are venomous. Mm hmm That's true. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Elite Pixel says my dog's name is Sif. Because my brother said it's a good name for a dog. <gasps> is your dog a girl? I mean, even if it's a boy. Even if it's a boy. An Alaskan Malamute. Oh my god, so cute. Like a big wolf. Like a big wolf. Can it be worse than America, though? God, no. We don't have guns. Or we do have guns. We don't have a lot of guns. <laughs> Pretty sure that's America too. Hey, <laughs> a Glasgow kiss. It's a it's a head a headbutt. Yeah, Glasgow kiss. <laughs> Beware of one and ties. Ties. <laughs> right, where do I do I want to do Sif? Mm. What are my options? Quailag. No, let's do Sif. <laughs> Quailag. Um, I could go do uh, Asylum 2.0. Stray Demon. That's so far away though, Sif is right here. I, yes, I did almost uh, walk off the edge. Yes, that's right, I did almost walk off the edge. So this, I made a video about this, but you don't have to spend 20,000 souls to get around to Sif if you're confident with the run. The run does have a couple little scary bits. The first scary bit is this bit with the golems. Um, depending on what you're using, you can obviously take your time and kill them one by one, but ain't nobody got time for that. Um, but yeah, this that bonfire we've just rested at is your closest bonfire to Sif if you want to get to Sif for free. Otherwise, it'll cost you 20,000 souls. And now that's like, you know, I'm trying to min-max here. 20,000 souls can do a lot for me. And give me one Pyromancy glove upgrade. <laughs> uh, I could do Pinwheel, but without a, a Firelink Shrine bonfire, that's not very appealing. I'll probably leave Pinwheel and Catacombs and all that until after Firelink Shrine is restored. Because I just hate the catacombs, man. Oh no, wait, hang on. No. Catacombs bonfire. Duh. Duh. I'll just rest at the catacombs bonfire instead of like warping back out. I would just have to climb slowly back out of the catacombs. That's um, the main way. Well, you can if you're like God, but I can't. But running from the blacksmith shouldn't be too bad. Are we disconnecting? Oh no! I don't know, did we do- what happened? <sighs> what happened? Nothing came up. My, uh, my OBS still has me in the green. It's like five seconds. I guess maybe that's just a YouTube thing we have to get around, we have to like, put up with. I still don't have a loaded stream in the studio. It's still just like a spinny in the studio. Yeah, it must just be a YouTube thing. Okay. Sorry, I was talking about, I was talking about the catacombs <laughs> to nobody. Okay, so go over here, go over the bridge. Do we go over the bridge? Yeah, we go over the bridge. No, do we? I always forget. Do we go over the bridge or not? No, we don't. We don't. We go this way. No, do we go over the bridge? 
No, we don't go over the bridge. Yeah, I always forget. I always yeah, we go this way. And then the cats are around here. Also, please don't do the capital letters. It stresses me out. I've got anxiety. Right. No, we do go over the bridge. What are you on about? What are you talking about? It is over the bridge. For goodness sake. Because there should be cats. You should come through and then there should be cats. Is there cats here? Is this where the cats are? Yeah, this is where the cats are. This is where I want to be. Don't worry. I'm not your guy. I'm not your guy. Don't worry. This is the right way. I know where I'm going. Okay. No stress. I'm sorry. I'm very easily stressed for someone who plays Dark Souls for a living. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so we're going to Sif, right? It's don't chill. We're going to Sif. Everything's going to be fine. It's fine. <laughs> don't worry. Okay, uh, ideally, if I can do this first try, that would be great. But again, I'm not too confident with Sif. I'm kind of, uh, I'm kind of worried about. I've got six Estus. So I could try without Power Within just to make it a little bit easier. Or we do Power Within and we just nuke her. Hmm. Huh, what would you do? What would you do, guys? Would you go, like, um... Like, the sort of risky route to try and get it done faster? Or would you play more... Can you be my guy, though? No, I'm nobody's guy, sorry. I'm nobody's guy. <gasps> Chap. Chapette. <laughs> Hi, Thomas! I was wondering why I didn't get a Twitch ping. Oh, yeah, no, oh, sorry. I'm just, um... I wanted to put some love back into How to Souls for a bit. And also, since Twitch, we're like, you can, um... You can stream on YouTube now if you want. I'm like, oh, that's cool. Let's do that. <sighs> okay. Uh, oh, let's go risk. Let's go risk. High risk, high risk reward. Okay, let's go. Also, I still didn't uh, didn't put my fire orbs on the... I still... I keep forgetting. Right, next bonfire, okay? Next bonfire rem reminds me I need to attune flame orb. <laughs> my attention span. <clears throat> okay. All right. Ow! Oh, my dog is sleeping. Yeah, let's go combustion. She keeps hitting me as she jumps over me. Like just with the, I did it again. It's every single time. Keeping an eye on the health. Camera is not my friend here. All right, let's go for a heal. just sticking under her legs she's not being very zippy um the fast attacks are a pain but yeah she's not being that zippy actually usually she's more zippy oh that fast attack though right get under her there we go and then heal much safer Just under the front legs. Getting slow. Oh, I'm out of combustion. No, sad doggy. Can still kill you though. Sad dog can still kill you. <laughs> no, it's so sad. No. Oh, rest in pieces. Yeah, Sif has a lot more health than I, I, I always need to remember. She has a lot more health than I think she has. <laughs> Don't forget the ring behind the gravestone. Don't forget it. Um, 
Oh, 40k, very nice. Okay, so when I rest here, I will go back exactly where I need to be. Right next to my shortcut back to Firelink Shrine. Yeah, it's skewy. It's because I've locked on. I just find it a bit easier locking on. Yeah, that was good. That was good. This boss always made me sad. I wish they did something like patches in ER where you could let her be. There should be the option. Yeah. And also because of the integration like with the DLC, right? There should have been an option if you had saved Sif in the DLC to not have to fight her and she just gives you the ring because the DLC is so convoluted and, and complicated to like get through. And then Manus and Artorias are like the hardest bosses or whatever. So like, if you can do that, I think you should get a free Sif like kill and Sif should just give you the ring, in my opinion. <laughs> it should be like the secret hidden, like easiest way to fight this boss, just kill other bosses first, save her in the past and she will remember you. Um, I remember really, that was my top like wish when they announced that they were remaking this or <laughs> remastered in, I was like, please add something to the Sif fight to like have that kind of like Easter egg interaction, but no, they didn't. <laughs> it's so sad. It's very Dark Souls, <laughs> right? It's a shame they didn't make this fight optional. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Oh, hi, Dave. Hello, tallest of Daves. Welcome in. Pyromancy only. I got to say, I'm actually more and more, the more I do of this run on stream here, the more I wish that I had streamed it from the start because it was so, please believe me, I know it seems really easy now and I'm doing pretty well, but it was so hard in the beginning, right? It, it took me hours to get Capra Demon last night. I was playing for like three hours. Do you think we'll ever get a full remake? I think it's uh, definitely, it's a definite possibility. I think because Demon's Souls was so good. Um, a remake of 1 and 2 would be so good. It would sell. It's like a license to print money, right? I think, actually, that that might be why they haven't brought 2 and 3 to, like, the Switch or that yet. Or, like, remastered them. Not that 3 needs a remaster, because it came out in 2016 and it's gorge, but... I don't know why I rested there, I just did. <laughs> Um, oh, oh, I want to try something. I want to see if the Dusk Crown ring. Oh, also, oh no, I never got Dusk's. Did I get Dusk's? Ah, oh, bums, I never got her. You have to summon her. So you have to summon her to get her? No, you go back. Ah, oh, balls, we have to go back. I'm sorry, we have to go back, guys. <laughs> we have to go back, but it's fine. Wait, that applied immediately. So I still only get one power within. Ooh, but I get 24 combustion and 24 fireballs. But this is one shot territory. This this size of health bar, this is... I don't know how I feel about that. I'm very rusty. It's never gonna happen. I'm still hoping they remake Kuon. Yeah, but that was nowhere near as popular as like Dark Souls was, right? Two needs some love because it's such a good game, but people just assume that it's bad because people say it's bad. It's not. It's just not Dark Souls 1. Bapale, Winf. Winf. Yeah, I'm gonna need to go back, guys. Sorry, this is kind of embarrassing. Um, I'm just wanting the, the helm that makes me do more uh, magic damage. I was ah uh, drinking milk. I, we didn't, I we didn't need to know that, but cool. <laughs> I've got Vim too. Ah, she's drinking on stream. That's proof that it's really her boyfriend playing the game for her. Little do they know, guys. Little do they know. One-handed master. Well, I don't think I really have that title anymore, but never mind. It's been a while. It's been a while. Oh, we gotta go all the way back down. Oh. We should just race to Anor Londo so we can get Bonfire Warp in, huh? In comparison to Dark Souls, it might as well not exist. <laughs> Always happy to get a horror though. I would play that. I'd play that, Miss Warner. I miss our emotes. How am I supposed to express my emotions? I know. I know, Poshy. But, hey, 
uh, how to souls is really really close to partnership and uh, i would never ask anyone to like sub on both platforms but i do have a 99p sub option like i get to p i get to pick my price for subs on youtube uh so basically you could get youtube emotes here but it would be like 99p so that's pretty cool <laughs> i like the option of being able to do that because obviously i wouldn't be streaming on youtube as much as i would be on twitch so there's no way i could really ask for like five pound a month on youtube but i love that you can make your own tiers i love that Sorry, I mean on my main channel, on Don't Reach Quit, I have a 99p tier. I hate Dark Souls on Switch, because it can't online. Well, it can, but you have to pay. You have to pay on PlayStation as well. You have to pay for PlayStation too. But yeah, Posh, yeah, so we're, um, last time I looked, was it this morning? We were eight hours away from partnership, which is very exciting. So if we hit that and I can apply and I can get the uh, little sub badge of you stuffies. Yeah, it still says eight hours away. I think we'll get a wee bit off the stream. I think that's how that works. This counts as watch hours, right? Right. But I don't think it updates in real time. Okay. Oh, it's not. Oh, I need to talk to her first. Do you have to be human? I don't think you do. You have to be human. Sorry, I'm just slowly walking across the lake. <laughs> Does the live stream... That's why I'm hoping, Poshy. Yeah, that it counts. So I'm live for two hours today. So if four people are watching for two hours, then it counts as eight hours, right? I don't know. Talk to... Yes, please don't tell me what to do. Thank you. It stresses me out. Hello Lee! Yeah, game is good. We got a couple bosses down. Um, the I think the hardest bits I haven't... I didn't stream, which is kind of funny. Because I'm like, my stream title is oh, This run is so hard, by the way, but like I've only streamed easy mode. Maybe, maybe stream gives me the power. Maybe it gives me the power that I need. Uh, on my levels, the game looks like it's really quiet. You should <gasps> do not knock me off the edge bro 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 where am i gonna spawn <laughs> did i re i didn't rest ah bro no i haven't done havel yeah just helping out no you're not helping out you're like telling me what to do it's really stressful um the difference between so if i go like is that right or if i go like oh what's that again and then someone answers me that's helping me out but like shouting at me in all caps and telling me to do stuff that I am already doing um, is really stressful. So if you want to hang out and have fun, I'm cool with that. But I just, I just have a couple of rules and that's one of them. Don't knock me off the edge. I can do it myself. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, flipping golems. I can do it myself. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Maybe I should have taken the time and just killed them because this one time, this one time I was trying to talk to Dusk. <gasps> it was one handed. It was the one handed run because I really wanted hidden body. <laughs> I was trying to talk to Dusk and a golem came over and killed her. I couldn't believe it. Uh, so I couldn't get hidden body until I did the DLC. I was so sad. <laughs> Trust me, I know the game. Yeah, I know the game like really well. Sometimes I forget things, but like if I forget, I'll like I'll ask. Yeah. How much views are you on Twitch? I don't really want to talk about that. I'm not really like I'm not really doing this for. Well, I suppose I am doing it for views. <laughs> um, but yeah, Twitch is uh, Twitch is a lot more popular than YouTube for me. I'll put it that way. I, I just want to as well I want to say thank you to everyone for tuning in today because I was like very nervous I thought I'd be like talking to myself and I'm okay I'm okay with talking to myself I don't mind it I don't know if you could tell that about me when I'm playing when I'm doing YouTube videos I'm I'm okay with talking to myself <laughs> but uh it's so nice it's it's so nice because I know a lot of you are working 
so it's nice. Yeah. All right, so I've rested now, so if I do accidentally walk off a cliff, then we're fine. <laughs> well, we're not fine, because I quite like those 50,000 souls. <gasps> right, focus mode. 50,000 souls, right? Let's just, t let's just go painfully slowly, okay? You were at the pub, Dave, man. It's on my bucket list to go to the pub with you. I wish you were coming to Edinburgh. You always seem to be out when it's a nice day. I'm always very jealous. Where's my invite? That's what I'm saying, Nikki. Where's my invite? <laughs> Nikki, I'm. Uh, I was planning on driving tonight, but I could um could ask for a lift. I'm not paying for a taxi. I could ask for a lift. See what he says. I don't know what he's doing tonight. Would love to come to Edinburgh. I would love you too. I smashed my work today so I could sit in the van and watch. Oh my god, that's so cool. That's really cool, Potter. It was a, it is a big deal to me because I know like obviously Twitch is like your platform of choice and I don't blame you because it's mine. But you know, I had to try this out. I had to see how it went. And if people are interested, and if it, you know, you never, you know. <gasps> Jawa, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Oh, that got a crit because he was jumping back. That's so cool. Yeet. 200 souls apiece, not gonna say no. Not gonna say no. Right, no golems to hurt her. Here she coming. She coming. There's a weird separation in my head. Twitch is where you watch stuff live and then YouTube is where you watch pre-recorded stuff. Yeah, I have that too. Yeah, for sure. I just uh, I just really love this channel and I want it to do well. Um, so I'm like, oh, what if we did a little Dark Souls stream? What if we played some Dark Souls? Uh, oh, okay. Hidden, right. Think, think to yourself, Rach. Could you use this? Could always use Hidden Body. But... It's not a pyromancy, so no, it no, I'm I'm not, I'm not gonna use it. Um, so is it we just uh, talk to her, exhaust her dialogue? I was stuck in a golem. The sorcery is a villa seal. Is that the last? Yeah. Okay, so now I think we can get away with um, quitting out. I don't think we need to restart. Hmm. Sorry. I don't think we need to rest. Is it rest or quit out? Hmm. My favorite pyromancy spell in Dark Souls 1? Oh, the big red one, the big lava. Oh, lava, um, great chaos, great chaos fireball, I think is the one. The one that leaves a big pool of lava behind it. Uh, you get it from Quelag's sister. That one, that's the best part. Although Firestorm is pretty good too. There's not a lot to choose from in Dark Souls 1. I didn't know to kindle bonfires until I saw your video. Yes, Jawad, it's really, um, the game doesn't tell you, does it? It just expects you to figure it out. Do you need the DLC for the golem? Yeah, I imagine you do, yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, it's not on the base game. Wait, nope, not on the base game. Do you what do you mean, GRH? It's part of the DLC. Wait, oh god, oh sorry. Um, I thought you meant like Prepare to Die Edition or Remastered Edition. My brain is still in like 2011. <laughs> Gamertag, will you be checking out Steel Rising? It's a Souls like will you play as an automaton in 1700s Paris. Steel Rising? Oh god, I haven't even heard of that. Is that kind of like the, um, like the Surge? type style. Oh, Dusk is in the base game. Oh, well, there you go. There you go. I didn't know that. <gasps> Hello, Brock. Good morning. Surprise. Hi. How are you? How is Seattle today? It does say that you can kindle bonfires. Yeah, okay. Well, like, if you want to just, like... <laughs> I just meant... 
Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. I just meant, like, it doesn't baby you. The tutorials are very simple. It doesn't baby you. <gasps> Supernova blob! Doesn't resetting and reloading have the same effect on items, except that reloading doesn't respawn enemies? Items. Items. I guess you can, so for like a crystal lizard, you can. Good morning, it's night for me. It's afternoon, GRH, for us. It's afternoon. <laughs> I don't remember it telling me I can kindle. Yeah, like as soon as you get to Firelink Shrine, it's like, you can level up and kindle at bonfires. And it's like, yeah, how? How do I do, what does kindle mean? What does that do? And then you don't know, obviously you get humanity and you're like, what does this do? And it turns them. My dog is dreaming. <laughs> Did you hear her? <laughs> she was dreaming. Dusk is, still, Dusk is still there and I picked up her clothes. Although I guess that's like a projection because she is, uh, her like physical form, her like real form, I guess it's sort of implied that she was abducted by Manus. Wait! <gasps> oh! Wait! So what I've just picked up were her actual clothes from her actual corpse, right? And she was abducted by Manus in the present, taken to the past. And we save her past self, but her actual body is <gasps> sad. Yeah, that's Evie, she's dreaming. Hi, Nevi, welcome in. Yeah, we're gonna go kill more things in Firelink. Mwahahaha. Mwahahaha. I've got lots of souls. I've got 55,320 souls. So we're going to use that to level up my Pyromancy glove a little bit. <gasps> I keep forgetting to put Flame Orb on my flipping bars, man. Flame Orb on my bars. <sighs> right now. <gasps> I wonder if I can... Uh, hang on. Uh... Oh, oh, oh. There's my dog. Yeah, she's... <laughs> There's my doggy. She's lying on her bed. <laughs> okay, there we go. Yeah, Evie, Evie is my dog. My dog's name is Evie. Yes, yes. She's come fake. Legend of Zelda. Oh yeah, that's my Switch case. Yeah, that's my Switch games. <laughs> so cute, isn't she? She was being really cute last night. She gets very excited when she hears me coming down the stairs. She'll just be chilling with Mike in the living room and I'll be gaming or whatever. And then I'll come downstairs and uh, she will always get out of bed for me. Now if that isn't true love, I don't know what is. She always gets out of bed for me. Like guaranteed drops that are inaccessible being put in the correct spot. Guaranteed drops that are inaccessible being put- Oh yeah, then you would just- yeah, so like if you kick Loutrek off the edge or like if you kill an NPC but like lose their item, you just reload. Yeah, reload but don't rest, yeah. In Dark Souls 2, reloading doesn't reset lizards but resting does. Items and drops is confusing. So, yeah, for sure. No, I know what you mean. Yeah, I don't actually know a lot about Dark Souls Two in in that sort of way. Can't even think where you would. F I can't think where the Dark Souls Two lizards are. I know there's loads in like the Doors of Pharaohs. I haven't played Dark Souls Two in so long. I would love to do. I'd love to do Dark Souls Two walkthrough, but I'd have to like. I don't think I could do it right now. Like I would have to play it and then I could probably do a walkthrough after one more playthrough probably I would think yeah the game UI on 2 is trash it's the exact same as like the others but okay <gasps> hello fortunate fox I've been streaming Dark Souls Remastered to my friend and reusing your walkthrough as a guy oh my god yes oh thank you for thank you for watching thank you for I hope you've enjoyed I hope it's um I hope it's helped I don't have a... Uh... Did I rest? 
Hmm. The only thing that could go wrong here is that if I accidentally die on the way to... It's happened! Stranger things have happened! I have died on the way to asylum before. <laughs> I've seen it all, believe me. I think that now that I get the combat thanks to Elden Ring, I should go back and play 1 and 2 and 3. Yes, you should! 1 is going to feel very primitive. It's taken me... Oh, it's taken me a wee while to get back into the swing of 1. <laughs> Put it that way. Oh, hello there. Oh, two is more confusing because there's two versions. I see that's the thing as well. Like I played Dark Souls 2 vanilla. I played that so much. That's actually like my second most played Dark Souls game. But um but Scholar of the First Sin, I really didn't take to. <gasps> Plus 12! Get in! It's gonna cost 19,000 to get another Goodbye. stage. Oof! <sighs> we can actually get Quailana now. Where does Quailana sell? And also, we were gonna get put. Oh, lots to do, lots to do. I think we'll go do Stray Demon first, so I can't obviously rest here. Let's let's go up here. We've had four seasons of Stranger Things. Stranger Things have happened. It's true. <laughs> You'd have to do a walkthrough of Scholar because it's the base version, and that would be slightly less fun. Yeah, it's not as good, is it? <laughs> no, uh, there are there are things about Scholar of the First Sin that are much better. For example, DLC. DLC bosses, best bosses in the game. There are things about Scholar that are worse. For example, flipping Iron Keep. Iron Keep is worse. Iron Keep is very bad. <laughs> Lots of things are very bad in uh, Scholar of the First Sin. But, you know, we could, you know, I could do both. I could do both. I could do both. I like that live chat persists a bit on mobile if you have to quit out. On Twitch it just wipes chat when you quit out on mobile. It doesn't for me. Do you have a... Wait. Benjamin? <laughs> Did you just change that to Benjamin? I love it. Wait, no, I didn't want to go up here. <laughs> right, Um. so, because on my iPhone, on my iPhone, if I change... Sorry, if I change window, so it like shrinks down Twitch, right? It takes it to just the video and the video goes to like the top of the screen. And then I can like, if I want to re like full screen that, I click it or whatever. And it still has chat. Oh, but maybe it doesn't take, uh, it doesn't like take in new chat. Is that what you mean? Hmm. I can't think. But on YouTube, it just doesn't, it doesn't it like sort of save your place. Soul memory and limited respawns. Oh, <gasps> limited respawns. I forgot about that. That was such a weird like design choice. I think they were thinking from a difficulty point of view that actually it's just really annoying when you're trying to farm. Yeah. Oh, is that when I'm a mod? That's when I'm a mod. Okay, right. That's what it is, Miss Murder. That's when I'm a mod. That's when I'm a mod. Your health going down every time you die. That sucked. That was, oof. It was like, oh, hey, oh, yeah, hey, you're struggling. Are you finding the game hard? Good, you're about to find it harder. <laughs> Good. Scholar always felt like a ROM hack of DS2. I like both versions for different reasons. That's, I'm the exact same, love. I, yeah, that's what I choose to say. I like both versions for different reasons. If I go to Pip, picture in picture, chat persists, but if I quit out entirely, it clears the chat. Yeah, okay, yeah, I think that's the, yeah. This is my first stream, yeah, well, on How to Souls, yeah. First stream on YouTube, don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> yeah, first on YouTube. Never played the OG DS2, Dave, I love it. I love it, I love it, it's just, it's great. It has its flaws, but then so does Dark Souls 1. I mean, not many, but it's got them. Um. <laughs> Just playing this safe. Just playing this safe. Heck. I'm gonna go to sleep now, sleep well. Sleep well, thanks for hanging out. 
I love certain bosses in too. I love Pursuer. I love Pursuer. I love Pursuer. Pursuer was one of those bosses I had so much trouble with, like, to start. But then, like, those are often the bosses I end up loving. Like, I never love Redan. How did that happen? How the flip did that happen? I love Redan. I love Godfrey. I love Radigan. <laughs> How did this happen? <laughs> Melania. I love Melania. Uh... Wait, Emily, hello. I've only ever watched two other people's YouTube streams and they're never live. I always catch the VODs later. How do you feel? How do you find it? I've never watched a YouTube live stream. Although that's not true because I used to work, I used to work for a YouTube channel. So technically I would like, I was kind of like, I was like modding the chat kind of thing. But um, yeah, how do you guys find it? Like, is it is it a good experience? Is it like, is it fun? Is it easy to use? I'm still sad after all this time. There's no torch. There's no torch. We can't do torch only, blob. I love the idea of the pursuer, like a boss that just tracks you down. Yeah, but you keep killing him. But then there's the curse of the undead, I suppose. Oh, you're Canib, right? I right. I forgot that was your surname. Sorry, Canib. <laughs> Hi, um. Wait, I can call you M here, and people know who I'm talking to. Yay. <laughs> Sorry, pal. How's your day? Both versions of DS2 are available on Steam. Really? You can still buy the original? I find that surprising. Right, let's go get the doll. Let's go get the doll. When my tide comes, I al do I allow Loutrek to kill the firekeeper for the sake of showing my friend what he does? Mmm... Yes. Yes. Because that's just Dark Souls. I think, yes, I think it's a, so th doing the invasion on Lautrec is like such a good piece of Dark Souls, you know? You're scary. <laughs> you scare me. Heck, my excuse for getting hit is that I couldn't see him, he was in the wall. <laughs> right, we got the doll. Uh, no complaints, it's a bit weird that names are different and I'm not earning souls for pickup lines. <laughs> we could have our special YouTube thing and everything would all be very Dark Souls related and lovely and wonderful. Yes, yes. <laughs> Literally just woke up. Oh, flip, wait. Yeah, it's super early, right? 30 pounds for a game that came out in 2014? It's a bit nuts, isn't it? Uh, so the other way would give me the ring, the Quaylag ring. That could be good. Um, and, and... And, 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 Magic shield thingy. Yeah, let's do that quick. Always good, always worth getting. There's never any confusion with Posh Shark because Posh Shark is always Posh Shark. <laughs> Unless I'm on Facebook and then it's my crummy human name. <laughs> nah, not a fan. Not a fan of the crummy human name. Wait, do we have to, wait. Can we call you Poshy in Edinburgh Poshy or do I have to call you, do I have to call you crummy human name? Oh, I didn't do it on my first playthrough, so I got to prepare for it this time. I love that. No, yeah, especially if you know what happens. Like, I think if you're showing it to your friend, I love my one of my favorite things is like being a proper like. Oh, I don't know how to say this without swearing. Poop eater. Having a big poop eating grin on my face and showing someone something very unfair that Dark Souls does. <laughs> poop eating grin. That does tons of damage. And when it hits. I 
I need a bit more poise, I think. Especially when I'm doing combustion and stuff. We could get, um... After Quelag, I guess we could get the... We get the black armor. That's very pyromancy, isn't it? Black, gold-rimmed black stuff. Oh, it got me! I was rolling. That's Mr. Shark to you. I expect Poshy. Okay. <gasps> Poshu. Please, Mr. Shark is my father. <laughs> the name thing is sort of my fault. Changing my name to Brenda Jammin. Brenda Jammin. <laughs> Brenda Jammin. I like that. I like Benjamin as well. You can create a new YouTube channel to change your screen name. I can't remember. Like mine was mine was my full name for a while, and I can't remember if I still have that full name account. Is that a separate account? Fire orb might hit the two of them. I can't wait to get the the like lava one. Oh no, the other one's in the back. He's not coming. He's not coming. <gasps> Once I learnt parrying in Dark Souls, Black Knights became almost a joke, which is so weird, right? It's so satisfying. But parrying in one and Demon Souls is a lot easier than later games. Bloodborne, <gasps> Bloodborne parries are you feel so cool, you feel so cool. I learned to parry in Elden Ring just so I could have like this proper badass way of fighting the Crucible Knights. And now it's like I can't really imagine fighting them without parrying them. It's too much fun. Oh, it's linked to your Gmail account, but it's a different ch it's a different channel. That's it. But it's the same account, but it's a different channel. And then you log in with that channel. Yeah. Hey, Vicky. It's really good. Thank you. We're making really good progress, actually. Yeah. Um, level 19, which feels really low in Elden Ring terms, but it's like not bad in Dark Souls terms. It's weird. <laughs> and you can edit your YouTube name on your account as well. But yeah. <laughs> So yeah, you were Emily, because I know I know your name from YouTube comments, but I never clicked that that was that was kind of that was kind of M. I never clicked that. <laughs> uh, I'm a little bit worried about um, uh, Stray Demon's health. How much does it take to punch you to death? Twelve damage a hit. Yeah. Okay. Right. I'm just gonna try and get one fireball to hit both of them, if possible. Cool, perfect. Efficiency. So I've got six Astus. Hopefully I don't need more than that. He's got loads of health. I don't know what his fire resist is. Look, let's just try. Let's just have a try, okay? We'll go straight in with the fire orbs to start while power within is open. Oh! I died! I was, uh, I don't know, I was rolling. I guess it was at the end of the roll window. I don't know. You can parry an Elden Ring, yeah. <laughs> you can parry, you can parry Melania, Dave. Hear me out. Hear me out, you can parry Melania. You can't rip off until you parry her like three times though. Uh, oh, that was not ideal. Dying is not ideal. Yeah. Also getting randomly hit in the back is not ideal either. Right, you guys wanna group up? You guys want to group up so I can try and... If I don't kill them, they're just going to group up. Uh, they're just going to come down. Fat. Okay. Right, will we try that again? <laughs> we gonna... We try that again, yeah? Yeah, we'll try that again. Right. I'm dead! This is the worst stray demon RNG I've had, I think, ever. What a pleb. 
I've wasted quite a lot of power within. Uh, quite a lot of Estus. I was... I can't get behind him. Right, I'm playing like crap. I've forgotten it! Please, someone help me! Someone help me! I've forgotten how to play Dark Souls 1! <laughs> this is so distressing for me. Uh, Volt timings are much earlier than they are in Elden Ring. I think me trying to parry Melania is just asking for trouble. Well, hear me out, Dave. You've tried everything else. You've tried everything else. What have you got to lose? <laughs> when I see the basilisks in Elden Ring, I get flashbacks to the sewers. Oh, so good, though. It's so, like, I love that they brought them back. They're in every Dark Souls game. More hours of my life. Yeah, but, like, what if you... What if you get her though? What if you do it? What if what if you level one millennia parrying her? Oh, Just become parry god, easy. <laughs> okay, yeah, I think I was really thrown off there. I got a really bad like start. Need to get back used to the dodge timings and also, one thing you'll learn if you're new to the channel is I'm like very hypercritical of myself. So that's fun. I'm sorry. I've got very, um, very, very high expectations of myself. I get really mad when I die. <laughs> so, if we can just. Thank you. Thank you. That's what I'm talking about. Need to get out of here. There we go. Wanna play Dark Souls 3 when it's like $30? See, Dark Souls 3 I think is much more worth $30 than like Dark Souls 2, if that's also 30. 3 is oh, it's so good. It's really good. Wait, that's not on sale? Is $30 not on sale? Fireballs and some combustion left. Power within has run out though, so we're doing a bit less damage. There we go. There we go. Jeez, man. Okay! Straight even not that weak to fire. Not that weak. GG! Elden Ring Basilisks are really interesting. I wonder how their appearance might develop if they return again. What's different about them? They look the same to me. Like, mostly the same. What's what's actually different? I guess their eyes are not as, like, wibbly, right? Hi, Anna! Dog champ! What the flip? Oh, oh, my dog. Wait, oh, my dog champ? Hi! I thought I just, I don't know, I just fancy checking out YouTube, seeing what all the fuss was about. People keep, people keep leaving Twitch and coming here and I'm like, why? What's, what's all about? <laughs> yeah, we're good, Anna, we're good, how are you? Uh, Poshy, I have to scoot up the road and get washed up before picking the girls up. Thanks, Poshy, thank you for hanging out today. It was good, it's been good. It's been really good. That's three o'clock, so that's where I was probably going to stop for today. Because I'm going to go and see Nikki. 
But um, we'll just head back to Firelink and wrap up. Thank you very much, everyone, for hanging out. It's been really good. I wasn't really sure how this would go. Um, I'm going to hopefully get monetized this week. So if you guys want like sub badges and stuff like that, you can get them. I'm going to put them up for like 9 MP because I'm probably not going to stream that often. Um, and they show up in YouTube comments and stuff, which is well cute. Oh, hi Nick! Sorry, I was literally just gonna head, yeah. We had a good stream though, we made some really good progress. Do you guys want, um, would you guys prefer, should we, should I leave this play? No. I'm enjoying playing this playthrough, so I'm not gonna like stream it all on stream, but hopefully I gave you guys a little idea of Pyro only, and then maybe next time we'll be trying something else, who knows? Spear, spear only, I don't know. <laughs> okay, we back, we back, right. Thank you. I have no idea how to end the live stream, so I'll, I'll, I'll try and figure it out. Oh, their eyes are different. They have more detail. They've got like bigger scales and death mist looks neat. Yeah, or oh, flipping the whole like death animation is crazy. Um, if you guys want to join me on Twitch, it's on twitch.tv forward slash rage and that's where I'm streaming a lot of Elden Ring at the minute. Not much Dark Souls. The YouTube detour is fun. Yeah, it's good for, a, you know, Good for a little shot for a wee change, eh? How the flip do I quit this? Wait, end broadcast. Here we go. All right, okay. Thank you, guys. I had a lovely afternoon. I'll see you tomorrow on Twitch if you're about. If not, I'll see you on the YouTubes. I'll hopefully make some more videos soon. Okay, bye. Thank you. Bye.